The video will show you how to navigate to the accountant tools in QuickBooks. Please refer to the handbook that accompanies this lesson if you want to get the most out of this video. Let's start at the client homepage. This homepage allows accountants to review client's books. Navigate to the accountant homepage by clicking on accountant home in the sidebar on the left. You are taken to the accountant homepage. There are three main sections in the accountant homepage. The first is report and tool defaults. The second is books not closed. The third is reconciliation status. Report and tool defaults allow the accountant to set the specific periods or dates for report generation, such as month to date or quarter to date. You can also set the basis for accounting to cash or accrual. The close books button under books not closed allows the accountant to close books till a particular date which can be set. The accountant can choose whether the client sees just a warning or whether they have to enter a password as well to make entries for dates before the books have been closed. The reconciliation status page gives the accountant an overview of all the bank accounts in his QuickBooks account. The last date of reconciliation is also shown for each account along with reconciled balance and current balance. Clicking on the gear icon next to your username brings up the settings menu. For accountants, the settings menu has an additional column of options under the heading Accountant. The first option on this list is Reclassify Transactions. Clicking it brings up the Reclassify Transactions page. Here, the accountant can view a list of all transactions and reclassify any existing transactions which have already been posted. The next option under the accountant heading on the settings menu is voided or deleted transactions. Clicking it brings up the audit log page. This is an accountant specific page that allows you to view deleted and voided transactions by selecting any transaction. The next option under the accountant heading on the settings menu is write-off invoices. Clicking this takes you to the write-off invoices page. Here you can select, view and write off one or multiple invoices by ticking their checkboxes and clicking preview and write off. Clicking write off in the preview pop-up window confirms the action and returns you to the write off invoices page. To summarize, as an accountant user, you get additional functionality in QuickBooks such as the ability to reclassify transactions, write off invoices, view voided and deleted transaction reports. You also have an accountant dashboard for viewing client data.